Let me say, you're going to hear some good and bad about every city, maybe a little bit more about Detroit. But let me tell you, man, it's the people who are making a difference to make this city special. ago I decided to uh, do a documentary to show the positive sides of my city. I'm a native Detroiter. I love Detroit. Uh, Detroit's a great place. Let me present to you the great Detroit. It was, it is, it will be. I did my best to show a little bit of everything. I missed some people, couldn't do all of it, couldn't show everything, but here it is, the great Detroit. Hope you enjoy it. Hello! We know how to cut and edit. <laughs> I believe in Detroit. I really do believe in Detroit. We love Detroit! Ah! Uh, Detroit was initially founded by the French. Welcome. This is St. Anne's Church, the second oldest church in the whole United States. And what we know is that Detroit is filled with hardworking, blue-collar folks. We like that about ourselves. We consider ourselves to be of that Welcome yet. to the Ford Piquet Avenue plant. In this 67,000 square foot brick and timber building, Henry Ford built the Ford Motor Car. Well, you know, Detroit was an incredible city in the mid uh, last century. Uh, you had Black Bottom, where uh, many, if not most, African Americans lived during that period of time due to segregation when we weren't allowed to live in many other areas of the city. Uh, I love Detroit because uh, Detroiters have a thirst for knowledge and truth. I love being here and working in the city of Detroit. I have never been in a place with such a strong community feel and where there's such opportunity possible. I painted this and I'm from Detroit. Okay, so welcome to Puabic Pottery. Puabic is a historic arts and crafts era pottery. We were founded in 1903 by Mary Chase Stratton at the height of the arts and crafts movement. Today we are a thriving ceramic production studio, a ceramic educational center, and a nonprofit providing community outreach programs to 8,000 Detroit public school children and to pediatric center hospitals throughout the area. Detroit has probably one of the nation's only puppet museums. For us, for founders uh, who came from Russia, and we were um, theater, puppet theater professionals back there in Russia, it was, um, quite uh, inspiring to all of a sudden find out that uh, we're not accidental here. The Michigan State Fair started in 1849 and was held in Detroit, and it was the country's first state the fair. The market is the largest public market district in the United States and one of the oldest, longest continuously operating public markets as well. The city has put together a massive plan for a brighter future. Great. 